If you want to be able to share your presentation into a printable file format or on a format that preserves the formatting of the presentation, that might not be available on somebody else's computer or they just don't have PowerPoint installed at all. And then to go ahead and publish this, we've got two options that I want to show you. Come up here, click on the File tab, go down to Export, and we got Create PDF slash XPS Documents. Select it, and you can see it preserves the layout, formatting, fonts, and images. Content can't be easily changed, and free viewers are available on the web. So PDF is Adobe Acrobat, XPS is Microsoft's. So go ahead and click on it, and it gives you the option. The default is PDF. You can change that and say, let's do Microsoft's Document XPS. Well, your flavor. I'll do PDF. So on my desktop, go ahead and click on Publish. And there we go. It opens up in PDF here. And if it doesn't open up for you, then go ahead and you can go to Adobe.com and download their free PDF viewer here. You can see it's Adobe Acrobat Pro that we got installed, but in any case, the reader comes free. I've got the Pro version. And so you can go ahead and let's click on the drop down arrow to go slide by slide. Yay! Let's go ahead and close out. And if we want to do it again, we can click on File, go down to Export, and then see what it looks like when we export this to XPS document. Select it, create, change it to XPS document. Go ahead and publish it. Give it a second, opens it up, and there's Microsoft's XPS Viewer. And then to go ahead and go from one slide to the next, down at the bottom, click on Next Page, Next Page, and I can't see quite the slide entirely unless I click and drag. There we go. And go one page, and then go down again, and then back up. Cool. Then close out of here. It's on the desktop. There's my original presentation. Here's the XPS viewer with the extension .xps, and then here's the PDF file format. So you can go ahead and email those off to anybody. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel to get notified of the latest videos. And for great specials on my products, please see the description below this video.